Hey, <laughs> one ripped arm. <laughs> uh, hopefully, it sounds like it'd be too loud. Let me know. We'll adjust. Needed. <laughs> Must be. Uh, borderless window. Perfect. It'd be. Uh, that's all perfect. I love all that. Looks good. Bam. New game. You want to challenge the power of allied healing arts is reduced. Making smart tactics. Do you guys want to see? Why is there only hard? <laughs> oh, this is moderate. Um, he was not on 4K. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't have a machine capable. Um, would you guys prefer hard, or would you rather just like see more story? Would you rather see me have a challenge, or would you prefer just for me to get through the game? I know Hazy's answer, but... <laughs> Ugh, we have no tiebreaker. Hold on. I'm going to flip a coin. Ugh. All right, Hazy. Heads or tails? Heads you win, tails you lose. All right, Tails, you win. And the winner is... Uh, God damn it. Of <laughs> <sighs> course. Of course. Uh, I have no idea what any of this is. So who cares? Da, da, da. We'll go like that. Cool. Not the children. Anything but the children. You hide here, Velvet. I'm going back to help Celica. I'm so scared. Arthur, please. <laughs> You'll be just fine with these. Celica enchanted them herself. They'll give you the courage you need to survive. Sure they will. Now, have I ever lied to you? There's a first time for everything. I'll come back for you once Celica is safe. It's scary, but don't give in to fear. Don't despair, no matter what. I won't. I promise. After all, <laughs> I'm Laffy's older sister, and you're a student. I don't look good. Oh, 
crap, we're in Twilight. It doesn't seem like a good guy. But Tails games are actually really popular. It doesn't surprise me they have really good animation behind it. I guess we're gonna get right to it, huh? Damn. On that day, the world began to change. Men and beasts possessed by evil spirits. Hunting and killing anyone they could. But even in the depths of despair, only two things <laughs> matter to me. The taste of blood-soaked flesh. Mm, that's dark. <laughs> and revenge upon one man. Yeah. Luffy, time to wake up. Let me grab it with my, my, my strong hand. Okay. Morning. I told you to stop calling me Luffy. I'm not a little kid anymore. <laughs> grumble, grumble, huh? You must be feeling good. Hmm. Bit of a fever, I'm afraid. At least the new medicine's supposed to come today. Until then, you stay in bed, got it? What? Aw, but I wanted to go to the cape. Sorry, you'll have to wait. Can I at least read a book? I have no idea. Don't trouble your sister, Lafayette. I didn't mean to. Arthur, done chopping firewood? Yeah, enough to last through winter. But there's something else I need to take care of. Sorry, but medicine money will have to wait a bit. I can earn it myself then. Bring down a few prickle bores, and I'll have plenty to offer in trade. On your own? Arthur's first maxim plans must be solid and reactions flexible. All right. I shouldn't doubt my students' abilities. Sorry to put you in the spot. I'm sorry, Velvet. Whoa, hey, what's everyone apologizing for? We're a family, right? Right. I'll see you later. I whipped up some porridge for you, okay? Be back by evening. Thank you. Be careful, Velvet. Oh, I will. I'm gonna get my arm mutated. Uh, cancel, pause, open menu. Uh. Open menu, start skit. Start skit. <laughs> Next. Yeah, all right. Well, well, pretty straightforward. Hunt, hunt the prickle bores. This. Oh no. Burnished coin minted centuries ago. The silver should fetch a decent price. Rest up, all right? Don't forget to take some gels with you. You know, you're careless sometimes. I'll be fine. You just make sure. Don't worry about me. I'll be in bed resting. You better be. You better be. Yeah, no e-machine on Fridays. He said, um, what do you say? Tuesdays and Fridays, he wouldn't be able to make it. Yeah, new gerb. There's no jump button. Let me up. 
can't do that. Oh, but you can jump down there, huh? I see. Nothing else to explore. Mini map. Showing your current surroundings is displayed in the upper left of the screen. You can use it to check the location of your next objective, shops, and more. So helpful. If I'm on the hunt for prickle bores, I'd better try the tranquil woods outside of town. This mm. is for Luffy's medicine, so I can't mess this up. Somebody's parents are dead. <laughs> when I guess it's theirs. Side grave marker for Arthur. In Cecilia's unborn child stems gravestones of Veverin's parents and her sister Selica. Well, that's sad. Well, that's a bummer. Whoops. Didn't mean to skip through that. Nutmeg. Condiment. Gotta get all the loots. I hit the start skip button, but I have no idea what this. Nothing apparently. Prickled balls. Where are the prickled balls? <laughs> Anything over here? Need loot. hasn't requested his favorite dinner in a while. There's been so much going this on. This is Start Skit. And the village always <laughs> has him out hunting. Maybe he's just worn out? That does it. I'll cook him up some prickle boar stew, just like Selica taught me. That ought to pick him right up. A healthy portion of nourishing meat cures fevers and weariness alike. Her eyes really bug me. <laughs> Since the opening seven years ago, this world's really gone crazy. Famine, freezing weather, and worst of all, this demon blight that's turning people into monsters. Wow, I demon can't believe blight. that people can really turn into those things. It's a nightmare. Does no one know what causes demon blight? Or how to heal it? No. What we do know is that when people turn into those monsters, I mean, demons... They gain incredible strength and attack humans on sight. <sighs> Whoever named it the opening named it right. It's like someone opened a portal directly to hell. Come to think of it, Selica died during the opening, didn't she? It might be a good thing she died when she did. She didn't have to suffer through all of this. It's good that my sister died? How can you say that? Bam. Sorry. I didn't mean it that way. You're a real idiot. Oh, really? You know that? <laughs> Sorry about him, Velvet. That's messed up. It's good your sister died. <laughs> hey, Velvet. Is Lafisette feeling better? No, not yet. He needs a little more rest. I think. Aw, too bad. Tell him I'm looking forward to hunting beetles with him again when he's better. Right, got it. Lafisette's illness sure is persistent. Yeah, that fever still keeps coming back. Like clockwork. The medicine always helps a little bit, but still, that sounds terrible. Let me know if there's anything I can do to help. Thanks, but we'll be fine. At least we've got Arthur to take care of anything that needs muscle. And before he came, Selica raised me and Luffy all by herself. So now I have to do my best too. You sound just like your sister. That optimism must run in the family. I do? That's nice of you to say. But she totally saw. Arthur, like, holding her in the air. <laughs> I should probably.
probably stock up on a few things before I go into the forest. I don't have a lot of money to spare, but like Arthur always says, battles are won and lost with the preparations made before the first strike. <laughs> Apple gel. Hmm, I got 200. Oh, let's do that. Blood blade. messed up. Oh, well, he's not happy no more. <laughs> Come from all smiles to be like, oh. Beast becoming demons too. Mm. Things aren't looking good for the town. The demon blight is a punishment sent to us by the Imperians for forgetting the old prayers. Who are the Imperians? The four Imperians created the world. The one Imperian shall bring it to peace. Be afraid. When contradiction permeates this world, the time of suppression will be upon us. Are you okay? Want me to take you home? No! <laughs> Don't treat me like a child! <laughs> All right, then. Oh, it's you, Velvet. If you're going to the Cape, take care. Don't fall into the Shrine of Tranquility, right? I know. I'm not a kid. Of course, of course. You're 13 now, aren't you? I'm 16. Ow! Leave me alone! I don't want to go for a walk. Hooray! Save. save day created. Ah, yeah. Wow. Everyone here is such a bummer, dude. <laughs> I'm going to go to the cape first. Fine. <laughs> Dude, does the map tell me? Oh, it doesn't tell me. It just says hunting prickle bars in the tranquil woods. It doesn't tell me what, what it is actually. Well, this will be it. This area don't. looks promising. Can I go this way? Nope. Okay. <laughs> they never are. Dun, 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 dun. Comfrey. There! Pricklebore! Pickle bar. The mushroom. No. Aha. I shall get you. <laughs> All right, here we go. I don't know. Most games they play are unhappy. <laughs> I'm a sucker for a good drama, though. 
The combo attacks can be performed based on the number of souls each character currently possesses. Music's really loud. I may have to adjust that. Let me know if it's too loud for you guys. Uh, okay. Using a combination of B, Y, A, and X to perform a three-hit combo. That's B. Y. B. Okay. Nice. By sending or defeating, inflicting status on the elements upon enemies, you can get souls, allowing for more combos. <laughs> now it's dang souls. Stun the enemy to get a soul. Okay. Right, Prickle boars. Prickle boar meat. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, that's how it's done. Oh, I'm gonna turn down. Down. Do 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 do. Uh, we'll do higher movie volume. I think three will be okay. Okay. It was very loud. The cold weather's been terrible on everyone's crops, but at least the city will buy our prickle boar meat now. Luffy and Arthur have been hoping the mm, village could start meat. raising them, but they can just be so temperamental. I wonder if they could be bred with more docile pigs. What would we call them? Oinkle boars? Nah, doesn't sound this whole inner monologue thing What about Piggle Boar? Yeah, Piggle Boar. That's a cute name. Maybe too cute, though. We wouldn't want to discourage people from eating them. The JRPG, what do you expect? <laughs> a question mark? Why is it question marks? I can't do anything with it. <laughs> I'm gonna get you, prickle boar. Okay, already use up soul gauge. When she drops to zero, you can still attack, but she will be knocked back if you try to defend. Okay. Unleash a combo until your SG runs out and his attack is deflected. Okay. I'll be to defend. Defending decreases damage from enemies, but also greater. Okay. That's the camera position. Okay. Ah! Bring it. Right, here goes. <laughs> Arthur's second maxim: Know your foes and strike where they're weak. Oop. You actually use your SP thing. Get wrecked. Not bad. <laughs> Forty four point five hours. Forty-five is not bad for main story, but of course I'm playing on hard, so. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> wow. Apple gel. Hooray. Need that save point. Can't move that. For fantasy creatures, would it be something other than Pita? <laughs> right, here goes. that do? Not bad. <laughs> Getting auto modded. Should be enough to cover the medicine. I'd but better wait, bring these. This is to where the her store. sister was moited. No, it's just a stupid auto mod thing. It picks up every little thing. Because you said pussy. It auto mods that. I just approved it. It's no big. I think. I think uh, Hazy can. Approve it too. I've never really set up the settings on it, so I'd probably just like pick the thing. <sighs> this place isn't safe. That hole's gotten bigger. <laughs> I've told them a thousand times they ought to build a fence, but they keep saying it's forbidden land. Maybe it was Libtard. Even Celica <laughs> used to scare me with it. She was always, This is a gateway to the underworld. Well, I'm too old to keep falling for that nonsense. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it's Twitch's like built-in auto mod thing that's like it, ha it runs on the channel. Like I have it set at really low settings, but it still just runs. You're all good, man. I just approved the message, not be. Chipped copper coins. This is why you gotta look at every nook and cranny. Every nook and cranny. Ooh. Money, money. Broken artifact. Yes. <laughs> Depends on which N word I guess you're referring to. I'm gonna kill more boars. More experience. How come I'm kicking when I have... deleted <laughs> 
N O O D L E S. Noodles. The poodles. Right, here goes. Alright. Went through those real quick. So I only get three at the start, and then I earn more, it looks like. Okay. Must have missed that part of the tutorial. <laughs> I did mention something about the more you have, the bigger combos you can do, so. <laughs> Nico Nee. Mm, guarding. Is that all? Right, here goes. What is Nico Nee? Block that sucker. Blah. <laughs> okay. So even dodging uses the. Is that all? Is that all? Yes, that's just all. <gasps> so many Pregobors. Hey, the boars I hunted. Are you there? Whoa. Uh -oh. We passed. We passed, bro. Maxim three. Never waver once your sword is drawn. Control your feelings to control the tide of battle. I know, right? <laughs> Hidden arts. Focus on damage and attack range, but use more of your SG than martial arts. Searing edge is effective against beasts. Gain the advantage by exploiting your enemy's weak spots. Select arts from the menu battle from the battle menu and select set searing edge to A. Arts. Searing. Oh. Interesting. Oh, you can you can set up your own combos. Oh, cool. Uh, steering edge. Okay. Sweeps out a boot blade. Oh, so that's what she's using. She's using a boot blade. Okay. Steering edge. Steering no. Right here goes. Uh, this is uh, for Luffy. Uh, uh, uh. Get wrecked. Get wrecked, boars. Oh. Ah. Yeah. Huzzah. Mm, I don't think so. I didn't see one. Whoa. Let's get some range on it. Have a lot of health, actually. <laughs> wow, look at that combo. I did it. Look, demon piggy. Sorry. Art. 
Pride and anxiety. Pity for the enemy. Thrill of victory. Your emotions run too hot. That will be your downfall. <sighs> Agreed. It's one of her virtues as well. Huh? Yes, I know. But even so, she's got to... Nearing edge! Nearing edge! Nearing edge! Arthur? Arthur's fourth maxim. Never let your guard down, even when victorious. Got it. In Why do they have case, to say their abilities should be enough to buy Lafayette's medicine. I'll drop the prickle bores off at the shop before I head out. Head out where? The person I was supposed to meet is late. I don't think I'll be home tonight. I came out here to let you know. You'll have to pick up the medicine yourself. Yeah, reminds me of Arn. Right. From Final Fantasy X. Uh, one more thing. <laughs> I saw a group of demons near the village. Well. If you're attacked, run away. Am I clear? No way! I, I can handle a bunch of- Demons can only be challenged by those with the talent for exorcism. That's the cold logic of the world, and no emotions can change it. <laughs> because it's anime. Do you think I could become an exorcist? Why is it you think that birds fly? Because they have wings. And it's cool. Why? Well, without flying, they couldn't find food. It takes a particular innate talent to be an exorcist. Unfortunately, very few humans have it within themselves. Wrecked. All right. Tomorrow is Selica's Memorial Day. I'll be back as soon as I can. Who knows how to bring a lady I'll up? Make you a quiche, just the way she taught me. Level up. What, what? So many boar meats. I've got the meat. Oh. I wonder if those prickle boars were brothers. Maybe I should have let them go. But nope. then how would I pay for Laffy's medicine? Hunting took care of that. And it means food for us as well. I had no other choice. It was a rational decision. It's breaking but the fourth the fact wall. That I'm still worrying about it shows that my feelings are getting the better of me. <laughs> That's the literal answer. <laughs> Cuz that's where they created. Hello, my happy lady. Nico, here for groceries? Yep. Nico, and Nico. You must have been out hunting. Yeah, it was a good haul. Look at you, lady breadwinner. If you were a boy, I think I'd be in love. Good thing I'm a girl. Oh, yeah? You ought to do something about your style then. Uh, yeah. I kind of broke my comb. So get a new one. Sure, I'd like to, but... Hey, mister! How about a <laughs> sale on combs for the pretty girl? <laughs> huh? Oh, you two need something? I'm fine, Nico. I'm just here to pick up medicine for Lafayette. No! Why are you oh, song requesting? Uh, Velvet, <laughs> I already told Arthur, but I'm afraid the medicine hasn't come in yet. What? Why not? Is it because of the demons? Seems like the demon blight's really taking a toll they won't on the play city. Anyways. There's even a group we'll of people around though. here now. When's it coming then? I can't say. And I don't know how much it will cost. Oh no. Ugh. What is wrong with Midgand? I mean, don't they have an army or something? Those guys? The demons already routed them a while back. 
But this is funny. Weird. <laughs> Slip play queen right? in the middle of After the After all, your brother in law's an exorcist. You so sure about that? Arthur can't even use his right hand anymore. Poor fellow couldn't even protect his own wife and child. Ooh, man. Let me know when the medicine gets in. Uh, people here are pretty harsh. For now, here, on the house. Ooh. Man, these people have no shame. You didn't forget, did you? You promised to teach me how to make your special key. You mean for that apprentice animal doctor you had your eye on? You were serious? Beyond serious. Please. This is life or death for me. But I thought your folks weren't keen on the two of you dating. Who cares what people think? The important thing is my feelings. <laughs> I like the way you talk. If I were a boy, I think I'd be in love. Darn right. Darn right. Darn right. Luffy must be starving by now. I'd better hurry home. Yeah, I'm sure that medicine. I mean, there's always some kind of medicines in the world. Celica taught you how to make your special quiches, right, Velvet? Yeah, but mine aren't nearly as good as hers. Don't be modest. They're fantastic. Simple, yet elegant. That's because there's a secret in the cheese on the dough. You should try selling them in Taliesin. I'm sure they'd be a hit. We could make them together and take them on the road. <gasps> we could even wear matching uniforms. Would it make more money than hunting Fricklebores? Definitely, maybe. Even more so if you could lighten up a bit in front of the customers. Then it might be worth a try. I do want to buy Luffy a nice heavy winter coat. And Arthur's gloves are in tatters, so he needs new ones. Oh, don't be so boring. I get where you're coming from, but come on. Think big. Dream, Velvet. Dream. Think big? Hmm. No, thanks. I want a peaceful life with Luffy and Arthur. That's all. You're impossible. Then again... Maybe that's why your quiches taste so darn good. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, I mean, there's always been medicine. Not to say there's been good medicine. <laughs> or effective medicine. Orthy and Russ seem pretty down today. I know. They've been whimpering like this for an hour now. Well, oh, puppy dogs. they've always been a bit wimpy. The other day, that kitty Rolo chased both of them up a tree by himself. They're hopeless. Whenever it's thundering out, they both dive into my bed, shivering. Orthy, Russ, shape up. You're Nico's bodyguards, right? Start acting like it. <coughs> they're completely hopeless. Maybe. But they're so cute. So I forgive them. Well, that's an interesting technique. <laughs> Wow, really? Huh. Never would have guessed. I guess anything's a thing. I mean, there's still the practice of shrunken heads, isn't there? I mean, it still exists, anyways. Not in your world. <laughs> Hi, Selica. I'm back. I can't believe it's been seven years since we lost you. And the baby you carried. Oh, drat. I forgot to bring your princessias. I know how much you, Mom, and Dad all loved those flowers. And I know your child would have too. I'm sorry. I'll pick some from the Cape tomorrow. Thought Virgil. Yeah, E Machine isn't here tonight. The machine is not with us. <laughs> Good. <laughs> uh, welcome home, Velvet. Luffy, I told you to stay in bed. 
I was drawing pictures. It was only up for a little. Look, your fever hasn't gone down a bit. Go lie down and I'll cook dinner. I'm sorry. What's this? A compass. It uses a magnet to tell you which way you're facing. Woohoo! You can use the sun and stars for that. <laughs> and what'll you do if it's cloudy, huh? Thanks to this invention, we'll even be able to voyage across the ocean. See? It's designed to stay level, so your heading will be true even when the ship is rolling with the waves. Pretty neat, right? If you say so, Luffy. Come on, it's a must-have for any adventure. Can't you see how useful it is? Useless, just like you. You can tell me more about it later. Fever's getting to him. Everyone knows compasses are fake. Not a scratch. And I brought back plenty. I can hear Arthur already. Gosh, Velvet. I think it's time you learned all my secret arts. He isn't coming home tonight, is he? How do you know that? Sarah stopped by and told me. Arthur's Moloch? Huh, you really can talk to Malachim, can't you? Yeah, Arthur says I know, I've right? got exorcist potential. No kidding. I think you'll be an exorcist to rival even him. I can tell you've been learning all sorts of things from his book collection. I really want to become an exorcist. I want to go traveling with you and see all the wonders of the world. I'll hunt and chop firewood, and if demons come for us, I'll defend you. And here I come wish, the demons. I wish I could do that. <sighs> You'll get there, Luffy Set. It should only take... Forever. Oh, 20 years tops. It won't take me that long. Oh, yeah? You better prove it to me, then. Start with this lovely meatball stew I cooked. Eat every last mouthful, even if you don't feel hungry. And take your medicine, no matter how nasty it tastes. No tricks. Am I clear? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> I like right. the way that Cooking you time. think, Jish. First, <laughs> I need to light the stove... You might not believe it, but I can do whatever I set my mind to. <laughs> okay, okay, sure you can. <laughs> wow. It's so easy to light Arthur's firewood. I wonder what his trick is. Um, Velvet? <laughs> Could you not put any spinach in the stew? Huh. You'll never grow up if you're picky with your food, you know. Mm, I Base know, isn't real. But, but just for today? <laughs> fine, fine. I'll leave out the spinach just this once. And I'll make it that curry flavor you like. Really? Thanks, Velvet. There's some of Arthur's <laughs> special <laughs> curry spice upstairs, isn't there? Oh, special curry spice. Mm. <laughs> Isn't this Arthur's book? Is Luffy really reading stuff this dense? <laughs> Poor kid's gonna squint his eyes right out. Observation of the Nameless. The day before Scarlet Night. Sis went prickle boar hunting on her own. She's almost as good a fighter as Arthur. So I know those prickle boars don't stand a chance. But I worry that she's too athletic to land a husband. Maybe she should try to be more ladylike. Little scamp. He just knew I'd be reading this, didn't he? We call that the golden shower. <laughs> Depending on how hydrated you are. Potato. We got a potato. There you go. Not spicy hot, but oh so delicious. Oh yeah, I saw Nico today, and she had very important things to talk about. She's she coming over to? in the next couple <laughs> days, so be on your best behavior. 
I will. Oh. I'm glad you've got a good friend. Yeah, we've known each other since no, forever. Sports. Still, Nico falling in love? I can barely wrap my head around it. Laffy, you know, if there's a girl you like, you'll tell Big Sister all about it, right? A g girl Hmm, <laughs> you're a stubborn little brat, so you might need an older girl to keep you under control. Oh, and she's got to be a good cook. A pro in the kitchen is a success at life. Knock it off, Velvet! You should be more worried about your own love life. Me? I I've got enough Not on me? my mind. For one thing, I've got to cook for you and Arthur since Salika is gone. Besides, getting crushes on strange men? I just don't see what so... <laughs> oh, he's dying. Luffy, what's wrong? Dying. Jump. Save Luffy. Are you all right? I'll bring you some water. I'm fine. You just said something funny is all, and it made me choke a bit. <sighs> as long as you're okay. Sorry, I went off on a tangent there. <laughs> Who knows what the future holds? Yeah, but what more can I do? I've got a duty to look after my little brother, and I'm serious about it. I know, but I'm trying to look after you, too. I, I want know what you Yona to be happy. Is. <laughs> That's all. And it's not just me. Arthur worries about you, too. Well, we're family, right? Yeah, that's what families do. Thanks, Laffy. For you? I'd kill every last prickle boar in the forest if it came Aww. down to it. <sighs> oh, what am I doing? I need to hurry and get dinner ready. It's burning. <laughs> We're going to come back and he's going to be dead. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> oh, bummer. <laughs> Good boy. You didn't forget your medicine. Well, I did promise. Tomorrow's a scarlet night. Yeah, just like that night that changed our lives. Um, Velvet, may I sleep next to you tonight? Of oh. course. Oh, what a nice big sister. Okay, let's see. Today, I've got to dry some meat and use that cheese I've been saving to make a quiche for... Laffy? Hmm? Laffy? Oh, he's dead. You little... Where have you gone? Dead. You better not have gone to the village alone. Uh, I bet your fever hasn't even gone down. Dead. Calling it here. Dead. I'm actually going to need to save and then uh, call it here for a little bit. Has Luffy been here? That's right. <laughs> uh, no, I haven't seen him. Good point, Jish. <laughs> Wait, that's one of Arthur's. 
Actually, it's a copy that Lafayette made. <sighs> a smart merchant would pay a pretty penny for this book. I gave him a fair trade. Lafayette, did he really copy all that by hand? Oh, he must have done it to buy that compass. No, though he gave it some puppy eyes. Told him I'd throw it in for free, but he said that it would be a bad deal for me. What an honest kiddo. He's a good lad, but not the merchant type. So, what did he use the money for? <sighs> I'm afraid my lips are sealed. You'll have to ask him. That's a jerk. <laughs> Of the dogs. Oh, I saw Loppy set walking around. Is he okay? He's not okay. Where'd you see him? He was headed for the forest. I'll help you look for him. Thanks. Do a sweep of the village, just in case. I'll check the forest. Ah, uh, things are gonna go bad. <laughs> I know. He might have gone to the Cape to pick flowers. Only Jish. Or <laughs> not only Jish, sorry. <laughs> only Hazy. <laughs> only Hazy with the darkness. Alright, folks. I need to call it for like an hour or so. I should be back in about an hour. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Hazy with oofs. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys want to pop back in, I should be back around 11.30, but I'll put up the stream for a few minutes beforehand, uh, just so, just in case you want to keep watching, you don't miss anything. But I should be back in a bit. Thanks for tuning in. If you're not going to be back, I'll catch you guys later.